What's good, y'all boys, man? I'm back with another reaction. This time I got Mr. Beast face your biggest fear to win $800,000. Bro, just let me know when it's my turn, bro, for real. Like, let me get a shot at this, dude. I done seen this dude right here go on the, uh, on the video about, like, four or five times. Like, he could have ran up, like, $5 million by now, but he sold every opportunity. Bro, just give me one shot. All I need is that 800000 bro. We gonna, we gonna do big things, you feel me? But now let's get straight to the video. Hit that like and sub button. Let's do it. My friend Mac is about to experience the Mac. scariest moment in his life. I'm just gonna let you know, I'm not afraid of anything. We'll see. You cannot scare me. Seal them up! You have to survive 10 minutes with a thousand spiders to move on. Oh, release the spiders! Okay. I'm capping! I'm not doing this. I don't care. I'm not doing this for 10 million! Fuck no! I lied. I don't want to be on Mr. Beast no more. No! Never mind! Bro! What is this? The reason we're doing this is because Max said no matter how hard I try, I get the... scared. Would you say you're scared now? I'm about to look. there a little bit. A little bit? Mm -hmm. And this is only one of many fears Mac will face in this video. What? Oh God. And if he can successfully face all of the fears, he will win $800,000. I'm not going to lie. This was way more gnarly than I thought Yo. it was. Yo. They had to put stuff inside his nose so they didn't, in his ears, so they didn't crawl in it. Bro, close your mouth, my nigga. What are you doing? Two, one, lift it up, lift it up. Oh, yeah. Congratulations on passing the first challenge. Let's go. <sighs> but Mac has to finish all of these fears if he wants to win that $800,000. They prize. didn't invite him? Mac, I know you're blindfolded, but trust me, just walk up this ramp. Raise us up. Uh, Why are you taking a knee? <laughs> what is what? Ah. Just, it's stand up, stand up. Oh. Go on, you're fine, you're fine. Oh. No, 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 no. Alright, you can hold on to it. That's cute. Uh, oh my god. Uh, okay. No. Mac, take off your blindfold. <laughs> Welcome to challenge number two. Oh. The next fear is the fear of heights. You're gonna stand on the end of that plank, unclip this so you'll be connected to nothing. No, nah, dude. Press that button and then free fall 200 feet. What? Without knowing how, trust, I'll catch you. No, no. You're no. shaking. Yeah, of course I'm shaking. I'm gonna fall off of this into, without a harness on. Yeah. I can't even see the ground. <laughs> bro, I ain't gonna lie. I'm not doing this, bro. I'm not gonna lie. You don't even know. Nah, bro. Nah, bro. Nah, bro. Nah, bro. That's like telling somebody, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know the trust fall? That's like trying to do a trust fall, but 300 feet in the air. He said he couldn't even see where he was going to land, bro. I'm not, I don't care how much money you're giving me, bro. I'm not doing this, dude. You know what I'm saying? Like, you could tell me, like, I can skip every Chick-fil-A line in the in the world, get a billion dollars, and, 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 and get any car I want, have any house. I'm not doing this, bro. I don't care, bro. Careful. Mac, I'm just going to tell you, even though you can't see the ground, you are very, very high up. Oh, my God, Mac. All you have to do is unclip it and press that button. Oh, my God. Yo. I want you to look at me in the eyes right now yeah. and tell me that I'm going to fall and something's going to catch me. Something will break your fall. I promise. Oh, my God. You're literally attached to nothing. Oh, my God. The clip is gone. Don't do it. Oh, my God. Dude. Don't do it. You don't have to do it. If you want to, you can tap out and just admit that you are wrong and you do get scared. No way. Uh, God, dude. Uh, bro, I'm shaking. I'm shaking in my fucking boots, bro. I'm shaking in my fucking boots. There's no way he's about to click this button. You look pretty scared. Oh my God. Five, four, three, two. One. Godspeed. Godspeed. Zero. <gasps> Is he alive? Is he alive? <gasps> Let me go back. I was scared. I ain't gonna cap. I was scared. <gasps> oh, shit. Look, my nigga falling. <gasps> I can't believe he did it. Now that I think about it, that motherfucker wasn't even placed. 
<laughs> if he would have bust through the net, he wouldn't even have landed on that shit. <laughs> Yo, that shit is hilarious. I can't believe you did it. God, he's a psycho. <laughs> and if you're wondering who my psychotic friend Mac is, he's actually a contestant from a previous challenge video. Bro. And sadly, he... That's what I was saying, bro. He was on a he was on one before, bro. There's no way he gets to get on this multiple times, bro. Give somebody like me a shot, bro. If Mr. Beast, if you see this video, or if y'all want to tag Mr. Beast, bro, let him know that I'm ready, bro. I'm ready. He ended up losing $800,000. But now he is on challenge three of six to attempt to win that money back. Nah, these the first two are. was insane. Yeah. The next challenge. Why don't you get a $5 car? Put 800 <laughs> grand inside of it? As you can see, this car is pointed towards the lake. I'm guessing you're going to want me to drive the car into the lake? No. That would be dangerous. As you can see, there's no gas pedal. Obviously, you can't drive it in the lake. Yeah, I'm so mean? stupid. Why would I think that I could drive it into the lake? Yeah, yeah I'm yeah. stupid, yeah. Which is why we're gonna drop him in the lake. Bring in the crane! Oh, what? Oh, Jimmy, 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 Jimmy. Oh, it is getting real now. Okay. Oh my God. Oh my God. All right, Mac, listen up and listen good. Once we drop you at this lake, the car will quickly begin to sink. And in the back seat is the 800 grand you've been competing for divvied up into eight duffel bags. However many bags you can save from this sinking car determines how much money you'll continue competing for in this video. Mm. But whatever you leave behind is gone forever. Oh my gosh, dude. I will never tell you that I'm scared. But I'm about as close as you can be right now. <laughs> I'm feeling. I can tell. Before we drop your car, I'm gonna give you one offer. If you quit right now. And admit, I scared you. I'll give you $100,000. Oh no. Even. Yeah, all right. He's not gonna take it. There's not a god. I knew that was going. Hey, no, let's take that. I knew he was gonna do this. I lost. My nigga, he had a thousand spiders in a in a glass barrel for ten minutes. He done fell off a hundred thousand foot cliff. Couldn't even see where he was about to land. You think he's about to quit because he's about to fall in water in a car that has broken windows? Bro, I'm doing this. I'm doing this. If I even got no air, like. If they told me, like, I got to sing the alphabet and then have no time to breathe and give me no scuba fit, I'm doing this butt naked. I'm doing this in draws. I'm doing this in, in Nike Pros. You feel me? Like, last time, it's not happening again. Three, two, you didn't got to give me no goggles. One. Oh, my God. Drop them. You've got about 20 seconds to break out of that car before it sinks under the water. <laughs> Back, the car's going under. Hurry up! Come on! I know you guys seen that TikTok, the nigga that tried to teach you to take the back, the back head thing off and try to break the window. My nigga, I seen the TikTok, a nigga was trying to break the window and that joint was not breaking. And look, it's not working, bro. If you ever fall in the water. Never mind. That sunk so fast. Oh my god. He's out. Oh. He's alive. Hey, uh, Mac. No, go grab that back row. Oh. All right. Somebody grab us. <laughs> the scariest part about this challenge is every second the car sinks deeper into the water, making it harder to get to and harder to see. Mm. So if Mac wants to keep all of his prize money, he really needs to be moving as fast as possible. Bro. But as you can see, that's not going to be easy. Saving bag. Oh my god, that's awesome. After bag, after bag. Mac, you are crazy. But on top of the fact that the car is sinking deeper and deeper, what Mac hasn't realized yet is that the last two bags of money are actually seat belts oh! in the back seat of the car. Dang, that joint at the bottom? 
Dude, Mac could be in an action movie, honestly. Well, he was like a borderline Olympic swimmer earlier in his life, which is why I did this fear. Wait, but it's like 40 feet down and the water is freezing cold. How can he hold his breath that long? Oh, he got another bag. Wait, you got 700 grand on the boat. Just stop now. No. Just stop now. Just leave it on the bottom of the lake. Uh, honey, please. The next... No. He might as well get that last bag. All right, he doesn't care. At this point, the car was literally at the bottom of this 45 foot deep lake, That's making crazy. it almost impossible for Mac to retrieve the last $100,000. Yeah, you know, it really cannot. It's black down there. There's nothing. Are you officially calling it? I can't see the car, Jimmy. It's gone. Yes. Oh, yeah. oh the boat's tilting. Wow, you are very athletic. Do you like this video better or the other video better? Dude, this video is like 10 times as intense. I know. And even though this looks very crazy, crazy. there's actually lie. seven safety divers on standby to make sure Mac didn't die. Your prize is now 700 grand. But from here on out, it's all or nothing. Mac has to face the three remaining. Hey, W Mr. B's, you know what I'm saying? Safety first at all times, you feel me? Just to walk out of this with his 700 grand. This one might be the hardest one. Ah, Just okay. go on. <laughs> Is it grosser than spiders? Just come on in. Inside this room is a metal box. In order to progress, you'll need to reach inside the box and pull out what's inside. Mm. Before you put your hand in the box, we're gonna need you to sign this. It just basically says that you can't sue me if anything in there hurts you. Yo! Just... No, nigga. What? What? You're supposed to keep me safe. Fuck wrong with you. Think I'm about to suck. Nigga, up the up it, nigga, the 800 million. Fuck you, talking about. Sign right there. All right, we got it signed. What is it, like an animal or something? Uh, there are things in this box. Uh, Just step up here. You put your hand in one of these holes. Okay. And there's a thing in here you need to pull out. Oh, dude, that is freaky as, uh, okay. I'm just gonna make sure it's moving. Stop. Okay, go for it. Ah! It clearly has not touched him yet. No matter what, once you grab onto it, you have to pull it out. What nigga, I'm thinking this is gonna be an anaconda in that motherfucker, like a feastables bar. Yo, I was like, I was scared for him. I ain't gonna lie, gang. It's our brand new feastable bars. <laughs> we got all new branding and a better tasting formula. Let's try it together. I am not gonna go soft on you. I'm gonna tell you honestly what I think. Okay, yeah, that's pretty good. The new formula is milkier. Creamier. We have our all new crunch flavor, the milk chocolate flavor, almond flavor, my personal favorite, and peanut butter. These new and improved Feastable Bars are rolling out now. Give us a couple of days to get them on the shelves in your local Walmart, Target, 7-Eleven, and I cannot wait to see what you think of them. All right, Mac, you ready for the next fear? Jimmy, I've been in this exact same room, and I've had a bunch of money on the line before. Yep. I'll tell you what, if you give me 500 grand right now, I'll walk. Do you guys hear this man? That's a smart man. That is a smart man. You can't, you, if you got the opportunity to win 500 bands two times back to back, and then you lose it a second time after you realize the first time that you should have took it, my nigga, you are dumb. He, he probably has bills to pay like me. So hit that like and sub button, you know what I'm saying? Hit that sub button, man, real deal. If you don't hit that sub button, man, you, you, you know what I'm saying? You really hating on me because the sub not going to do nothing to you, you feel me? But yeah. Anyway. Who asked for 500 grand? 400 grand. No. Hear me out. If you said 200, maybe 250, I would have considered it. All right, how about 350? No. All right, let's go. Next challenge. <laughs> I knew he'd break. <laughs> All right, I might have lied. That one wasn't actually that hard. But this next one is actually based on one of the scariest things I've ever done. Oh, there's no way. Fuck no! Oh, quickly he pieced it together. No, 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 there is actually no way. Come on. There is actually no way, Jimmy. Is it that obvious what it is? What gave it away? The tombstone with your name? Oh, <laughs> Jesus. For the next challenge, we are going to bury you alive for 24 hours. Ah, well, no well, way, wait. dude! And you can get out whenever you want, but you don't know what time it is, and if you leave before the 24-hour mark, you lose everything. It's a good fear. Yes! What? For once, I'm on the other side. <laughs> yeah, bro. Oh my gosh. It might get a little cold. Oh, no, and don't mess it up. So he has to try to like guess how long 24 hours is. But I don't even know if I could do this. Cause you can't hear shit. I'd be going crazy, bro. Literally. I guess you just have to like wait till like they disappear for like a long period of time. 
and then they like so stay up as long look this is what i would do i would stay up as long as i can you know what i'm saying like past when i'm tired until like they're not communicating with me no more even like because they're probably going to communicate if they don't just stay up as long as you can like literally do not sleep until you fall asleep and then do that one more time that's what i would do i'm sorry not to this is from my nightmares man it feels wrong being on the other I just try to drink the fucking water with the cap. What a excited. But also fun. Oh, what the? Oh, this is so freaky. The funny thing is that the timer hasn't even started yet because you aren't fully buried. It feels wrong saying this, but can you bury me faster? As you wish, Mac. Bring in the extra hands. Stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. <laughs> Let's officially start the timer. Looks like 24 hours just started. And I'm already freaked, so this ain't gonna be good. Max, see that rope above your head? Can you pull it for me real quick? Is this a trick? No. Next time you pull that bell, we will dig you up. And if it does not say above 24 hours, you lose everything. Dang. I will burn your house down. <laughs> and also the $700,000. Yeah, I was like, everything? Everything. Sweet dreams, Mac. Uh, don't throw the walkie talk. Oh. Is it that predictable? I already know they threw it. <laughs> I'm not even up there. It's so much more fun to be on this side of it. And to make sure Mac doesn't die in his own grave, he's gonna be wearing this wristband that directly tells us his heart rate and vitals. And no, it does not give him any way of knowing what time it is. Basically, I need to figure out how to keep track of the time. So here's my strategy. I could try to stay awake for two hours, sleep for 10 hours, and then I would be halfway done with the challenge and I could just do that twice and then I'd be good. With Mac's plan, didn't I say that? Bro, I be knowing shit, bro. Now in place, his first step was to pass the time for the next two hours. Well, it's no feastful bar, but I guess it makes hunger stop. But it was pretty obvious he was quickly getting bored. You're gonna be honest, not much going on inside this room. That's the whole point. And Mac being bored this early is a pretty telltale sign that he may not be too good at this. Because already within 45 minutes, Mac's idea of time was horrendously off. I think it's been about two hours. I'm gonna try to get about 10 hours of sleep, which should put me at the halfway mark. Even though the pro to sleeping is it will help Mac pass the time faster. First night sleeping in the coffin. The con is it's very difficult for him to keep track of how long he's been buried, especially when he's not even able to stay asleep for more than 30 minutes at a time. I have no idea what time it is right now. I'm a little creeped out. <laughs> Hoping for the love of God, it's been over 12 hours. I think that's where we're at. And because when I did this challenge, I was constantly woken up by my friends, Jimmy James! I thought I'd give Mac the same joyful experience. Wake up, Mac, are you okay? Whoa. Dude, you look like you just got hit by a truck. It kind of feels like I did just get hit by a truck. If I was to legitimately guess how many hours in I am, I think it's like... The longer Damn. Mac stayed in the coffin, the less... <laughs> bro, I zoned out because like I was so locked in thinking about, like, bro, how would I do this shit? But, like, then I just realized he smacked the walkie-talkie with a golf club. Like, the longer Max stayed in the coffin, the less he seemed to know what time it was. Well, I would be sick. I'd be hour 16. And because we like to build a lot of suspense on this channel, for the remainder of this sphere, you're not going to know how long he's been in there either. What? And even though Mac wanted to ensure that he was going to be there long enough, it was clear the claustrophobia was getting to him. Being in this coffin is scary. Like, that, and the longer I'm in here, the worse I feel. It's a crazy feeling. But eventually, when we saw Mac begin to grab that rope, we knew he was thinking about ringing that bell. That's the face of somebody that's about to ring this bell soon. There's no way it's been under 24 hours. God, I'm nervous. <laughs> I've been in one of these videos before, and I've lost everything. And the only reason I even am back here at all and got a second chance is actually because of you guys. Me screwing up that second chance all comes down to if I know for a fact it's been 24 hours. Bro, like I'm saying, if you know it's getting close to 24 hours, bro, just just sleep one more night. You know what I'm saying? Just, just go to sleep for a long period of time one more time. You'll be straight, bro. I'm telling you. I really hope I'm not making a mistake right now. Mac, buddy, pal. How you doing? Jimmy, I'm pretty nervous. 
I don't want to accidentally reveal the time, so no comment. Jimmy, I don't know how you did this for seven days, dude. I do not feel well in here. Yeah. Have you got to the point where you start to lose blood flow in your legs? And you feel like your back is going to fall out of your body? <laughs> Jimmy, I'm thinking about pulling this down. No comment. Jimmy, I'll give you 50 bucks back if you tell me what time it is. No comment. <laughs> all right, well, I got a comment for you. Just get a shovel ready, all right? Three. Oh, my gosh. She's about to do it. Two. This is it. One. Oh! Stop the timer! And now that back has made his... Y'all think he did it? I don't know if he did it. I don't know if he did it, bro. Decision. There was just one last thing I had to do. Do you mind if I tell them about Shopify while we unbury you? You have got to be <laughs> Shopify is a platform that helps entrepreneurs get started down the path they want. Sometimes starting a business can be scary, like getting covered in spiders or being buried alive. I can tell you, you do not want to be buried alive. But Shopify is here to help. If I hadn't started my own business, I wouldn't have been able to go to all the crazy places like Antarctica and make videos like these for you guys. And just like billions of other people have done with Shopify, you can get started today on your business right now. Mac, do you want to know how long you're in there? I have a feeling you're not gonna tell me until you dig me up. You are correct. And one of the yeah. perks of owning my own business is I can do fun things like send one of my friends to the Super Bowl. Back, Carl and Nolan each have their very own football for sale. And whoever's football sells the most, I'm gonna give you tickets to the Super Bowl. And I'm gonna bury the other one alive. All that matters is that you download the shop app and vote for one of them by buying either Nolan's or Carl's football. And now hey, that I w can afford this video, let's like, see if Matt- His ads during the videos are like, like top tier. I ain't like I ain't even want to skip it. I, I just wanted to see what he got to say. You feel me? Loses seven hundred thousand dollars. Hi. Hey, Jimmy. Uh, there you go. Welcome to the outside world. Now that you are out of the coffin, let's see if you are in there for twenty four hours. If the number I reveal is lower than twenty four hours, then you lose seven hundred grand. Mmm. Uh, yeah, I feel like I'm about to throw up. Three, two, one. Did the right thing. He stayed in there for 12 extra hours. That's crazy, but hey. He scares me. Congratulations, Mac. This means that you are now just one challenge away from winning all this money. Let's go. You should probably go shower first. Yeah, I smell uh not great. So far in this video, Mac has shown me it is very difficult so to scare him. But the final challenge of this video may just be Mac's worst fear ever. And that's because the final challenge of this video is a one-to-one recreation of the challenge he failed on last time. The last challenge. Hold this in front of your face. Don't look. Hey, I'm not looking. Don't look. I'm not looking. Alright, keep your eyes closed. Don't open them. Don't open your eyes. Keep walking. Don't open them. Don't open them. Alright. Open them. Doing that again. Nah, bro, I watched no! this, bro. Jimmy! I do not want to do this again. Stand here. I do here not want to do where this the cameras can no! see you. Okay. Oh. The last challenge is the fear of failure. Oh. We recreated the set where he lost $800,000 in this video. And like last time, the rules are extremely simple. There Dang. are four stages. Each has its own cookie with a shape on it. You have to cut out all the shapes without breaking a cookie. And if you do break a cookie, you lose $700,000. And for you specifically, it will have been the second time it's happened. This is from my nightmares, man. I do not want to be here again. Well, good, because I have an offer for you. You can quit right now and walk away with this 300 grand or risk it for the biscuit. I ain't going. And if you I'm leaving. I I'm not even finna risk it, bro. I'm not I'm not going home empty handed again, bro. I'm taking a 300 and dipping, bro. Fuck it. I bro, like I can't I can't cut out an umbrella, bro. Like, bro, what? Finish this final challenge win $700,000. <sighs> this is actually like a very, very big decision. Yeah, because that's not quite enough, is it? It's less than half. But if you lose again, that is $1.5 million lost on this set. Mm. <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> oh, he's hitting it. Mac, I know this is hard, but you're going to have to make a decision here. Mm. Do you want to go home with $300,000 or do you want to risk it all for this final challenge? All right, fine, I'm doing it. All right, to be honest, no. I'm glad. I want you to win this whole what thing. Are you if you look doing? at this iPad right here, this is exactly how long it took Mac to get through all four stages last time he did the challenge. 34 minutes and 54 seconds. So that's exactly how long I'm gonna give you again. Starting now. Don't break the cookie while opening it. There you go. 
even though he's going quick right now, might not be in his best interest, because if he accidentally snaps the cookie, he loses. 34 minutes. Oh, wow, you did it that quick? Scan, 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 scan! It's green. This is a much different deal than last time. So I'm gonna take my sweet time cutting the circle out. He is flying through this. Why is yeah. hard to open? Probably because you're like freaking out. You want me to try? Open it. Okay, hold my iPad. Hey, yo, hey! Get my nigga like two minutes back, bro. Okay, it's very hard to open. Yeah, what are you guys doing? I don't want to be responsible for that. Be careful. Theoretically, max strategy makes sense. Getting through the easier shapes fast to save all the time for Umbrella, which he lost 800 grand on. You literally still have 32 minutes left. Yeah, well, I'm gonna need all 32 of those for Umbrella. That is borderline impossible. Move out. Oh, I'm moving. Open it. Allow me. I ain't gonna lie. I'm the type after I lost 800 bands to uh to the umbrella. I'm gonna go home and practice cutting out the shape of an umbrella for the rest of my life. See, cause like you gotta remember like times like this, you know, it might come back on you. So you gotta prepare for the. You know what I'm saying? You gotta prepare. My nigga Max should have prepared. <laughs> clap, 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 clap. Let's go. Max, stop breaking my set. Bro, you guys gotta make these easier to open. <sighs> There's just no need to rush. You're literally using no time. I mean, you might need to go slower on this one because it's a lot trickier. This one's pretty hard. Not even close to Umbrella. I'm trying to get to the race before I start racing. God, this is so hard. Oh my gosh. Well, I don't need that anymore. I, uh... Um... And maybe it didn't break all the way through? Ooh, okay. Um, he still had 29 minutes left. He did the first two in four minutes. <laughs> I don't know why it did this. Oh my god. I did that twice. Here, give me your hand. No, Jimmy, please, I don't want to leave yet. No, Jimmy. No, dude, I don't even like. I don't even know how to feel right now. Like, right here, come on. <laughs> I have like so much time. Yeah, I'm still just not sure why you're going so fast. The umbrella. I just, I just know that umbrella takes forever. Yeah. Okay. Mac told me in this video that there was nothing I could do to scare him. And after putting him through spiders, a sinking car, and more, I really did start to believe him. Godspeed. The only thing that ended up getting to Mac was the fear of his own failure. Godspeed. Old his ass shit took the 300k. Bro, like, damn. That's gonna do it, man. Like, comment, subscribe. Hey, if y'all want more videos like this, let me know in the comments. 3,000 subs on the way. Let's do it.